What's up, y'all? This is Sorry back on the reaction, y'all, from the Fat Man's podcast, y'all. I got another reaction for y'all. Uh, before we get into this reaction, y'all, please hit that like button and subscribe button. I'm trying to hit 900 subscribe by the end of this month or by the end of my birthday, which is on December 5th. I want to say thank y'all for early birthday uh, wishes and stuff like that. I really do appreciate it. I'm I'm not a big birthday con guy, but, you know, uh, you know, thank y'all. Um... Yeah, if you want to go see the original video, it will be up in the description. You will see the uh, original video, and the link should be right beside it. And if you have any comments, go ahead and put those up in the comments, y'all. The comments uh, section. I do read all of my might not respond to all my death. you read them. Uh, I responded to some last night. No, I don't think I did all of them, but I did respond to some of them. So, yeah, I definitely do read them, y'all. Uh, I appreciate y'all comments and stuff like that. I learned some stuff from y'all. When you put up in the comments and stuff like that so i'm i'm really the you know i like y'all you know put some information up in there if i'm wrong you know what i mean that's all i like you know what i mean if you have a different opinion for me i definitely you know what i mean i like that but hey y'all y'all see it's daytime i gotta go ahead and i got ahead and work here early so that's why i got up a little early uh, this is like it's 12 36 so i gotta be at work at 2 30. i'm gonna try to do at least two to three reactions before i uh, head there, out there and go ahead and post these and stuff like that but hey y'all uh, the title of the reaction or the titles from the dc sorts uh I, I reacted to this channel before and uh the title of the video is woman bashes her father at at his funeral as a Trump supporting racist. Damn, I saw this going around. I saw this going around. It went. I think it went viral. This is what we doing now. You 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 bashing your own father on his funeral day, on a, on his deathbed. This is what we doing now. This is sad. This is sad. This is sad. I I could never. You know, even if your father did some stuff wrong, you don't know, bash him on his deathbed because I don't think he would do that to you. This is fucked up. This is how you. This is this is what this is what this is what these people do. This is what the people do. All this propaganda and stuff, hating Donald Trump, he's racist and stuff. Like this is what they did. To, this is what you do to. This is what they do to your kids, man. They hate you for having your own opinion. This is what they do. This is what they do, man. I don't know a whole bad story, but still, I wouldn't. I would never, never, in entire life do that kind of shit bash my father on his deathbed i can never even though he might do some stuff wrong i would never do that kind of stuff even if he have a different opinion from me i would never ever in my entire life do this we don't have no respect for fathers no more now some of you actually recorded this too so like they that this is sad but hey yo let's get up in here we'll see what's, what's going on uh i know she said he was a trump supporter and stuff like that this is what they do. This is what this is what college does to your kids, your daughters. Down bad. This is down bad, boy. All right, y'all. I'm going to mute. What you are is a racist, misogynistic, xenophobic, Trump-loving, cis-straight white man. Please know that while I am grateful and highly aware of all that you give in this family, I still don't miss you. When you died, I felt like there was a hole. I missed something, but it wasn't you. It was the idea of what you could become. Damn. I missed being able to hope and wish that one day you turn a corner and see the world from my perspective. I missed the idea that one day you might help me fight for the things that matter. I missed my fantasy of you. Because when you died, it solidified the fact that you'll never be what you could have been, but only what you are. And what you are is a racist, misogynistic, xenophobic, Trump-loving, cis-straight white man. That is all you will ever be to me. And Dad, before you tell me to respect the dead, please remember that you disrespected and disregarded the lives and deaths of entire communities of people with your ideology. You told me to never back down, so I won't. You know for a fact that even against you, I'm not afraid to share my peace. You are everything I aspire not to be, and I refuse to stand up here and sing the praises of a man who is the paradigm of white supremacy. So I'll take your racist mindset, I'll take your money, and I'll take your advice. And I swear to God I will make this world a better place, not at all because of you but in exact opposition to you. Thank you. Did, did they really just clap for that? 
they really just crap through that you gotta be out your goddamn mind this is what i'm talking about this is what i'm talking about these this is the fucked up mindset these days man because he got a difference of opinion from you He's a mon misogynist and all this other bullshit that you talking about uh, a Palmer uh, Dam or whatever fuck he said of a Of a racist or the white supremacy and stuff like that Still he's your father It looks like the dad might be white So you mean tell me he, he racist he fuck you Oh, let me not let me not go there he had intercourse with your with your mother. It looks like your mother might be black. I'm not for sure. She said white supremacy, so the, I think the father's white. Obviously, obviously he he was not that racist to white uh, to black people because he had a daughter by you. Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! This is this is crazy. You trying to show him the light? He a, he a man. He don't change his mind like that. Most men don't change their mind on stuff. Unless they prove him wrong, then they'll change their mind. But come on now, he's setting his ways. He probably 40 years old, up to 50 years old, 60 years old. Come on now, he's setting his ways. Just like you setting your ways. This is sad. I could never, I'm sorry, I could never, y'all. I, I would never speak down on my father on his deathbed. Could never. This is down bad. I, damn. Damn. Mind, mind. Insert cash or select payment type. How does it feel to have a racist dad when you are what he hates? He fights to keep the poor man poor and make America great. He can't see that his kids are dying We're the ones he wants locked up And he can't fight for his kids that aren't white If he just wants to stay stuck I knew that a time would come where I couldn't tell him thank you And now the time has come where I can't tell him thank you anymore And while he has done a lot of negative shit, He's done a lot of positive for me too that i'm very thankful for and i just really want to remember to tell the people in my life that i appreciate them and i'm thankful for them even the people that i have beef with even the people that i'm not so close to i want them to know that i'm thankful for the role that they've played in my life and making me the person that i am the black experience is literally an experience like no other which is exactly why i'm at an hbcu and pretty much only want to have black friends and partners just literally impossible to explain the black experience like you can have a black husband you can have a black child you will literally never understand the black experience so saying that i could be racist the same way a white person could be racist completely invalidates the racism experienced when white people experience what they call racism it's like they're being called a karen or they're being called a cracker or something when black people experience racism it's being thrown in jail unnecessarily it's being shot in the streets for literally doing nothing it's having your neighborhood gentrified. It's having your district redlined. It's having your health needs be dismissed. It's having you be perceived as overly aggressive when you're not. So to tell me that you as a white person experience racism the same way black people do, that's just absurd. I said knew she was a source of such warrior. You know when, when I'm telling I, I I know I'm right. Red is either red hair, blue hair, purple hair, green hair, or all all together the rainbow hair. They either fit they feminist, social justice warriors, or just goddamn crazy. I know I ain't tripping. I know I know I ain't tripping. I know I'm right. I know I'm right. Stop it. I know I'm right. I know I'm right. This I know I'm right. I know I'm right. <laughs> but hey, first of all, on the gentrification thing, if you bring that property down, that's what they do. They want to, you go ahead and move up in there. Most people, most, if I'm rich right now, I would have done the same motherfucking thing. All y'all go here, bring the property down. I'm going to bring my millions, $10, $10 million, 
20 million dollars and i'm gonna buy the whole block hey that's how it go that's how it go if y'all it it's so crazy it's so crazy that you don't even know any property out there if you own some of that property right there you wouldn't even get uh gentrified ma'am i don't even know what the black experience is either nobody has explained that to me i'm sorry i've never you know i got pulled over yesterday i got pulled over yesterday right because you know i was swerving and everything he thought i was drunk and stuff i said no I'm, no no i'm not drunk man you know i'm just you know my bad you know i wasn't really paying attention he asked me if i was on my phone i probably was <laughs> but i told him no he was a nice officer he said can, can i get your id yeah here you go he asked me what kind of car is in my company's car it's a rental for my company's car he you know what i mean if you like he said do you want uh can you give me your id i said yeah i, I don't drink he asked me do you drink no i don't drink you know i'm only he i told him no i don't drink you know yeah he checked my ideas like, oh yeah he don't drink because i'm 20 you know stuff like that so most guys i know is nice as hell this is my what, fourth fifth stop getting pulled over i i don't get no tickets or nothing like that only time i got tickets when i was 17 because i had ran a red light and everything like that then you know what i mean but th 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 what do you talk do you talk about an officer killing you just for walking stop it it'd be your own people trying to kill you i'm sorry i know y'all want to hear this i i know you little you little sensitive and stuff like that but goddamn, you you know what it is you know what it is the officer even had the gun with me with his head I just man why y'all cops out the bright ass light that shit's like god damn damn we would go blind but yeah th th this is crazy this is crazy i would never speak on my father like this i don't care if he white black mexican purple uh uh a uh, green uh blue i would never ever do that i couldn't do that i got too much love for my father man i got too much love for him i would never bash him on his on his deathbed you call him racist and stuff like that because he supports donald trump and i don't know the whole the full story he probably she probably said it but you know what i mean did she say he had a poor man's mindset because he like donald trump oh okay Okay. All right, y'all. That's the end of the video, y'all. Please hit that like button and subscribe button, y'all. I'll try to hit 900 subscribers by the end of this month, y'all. So please do share this video with everybody that you see, your family, friends, whoever you see. I'm going to give you an upgraded mic, y'all. I'm going to give me a computer on Black Friday and all that shit. I might even get an upgrade on the camera. I don't know. I say, I think the camera is good, but, you know, I might get I might get another one. I think the mic is a little, a little funny. Y'all tell me in the comments, though, if it is. If you have any comments, yeah, put those in the comment section. I do read all of them. I might not respond to them. I definitely do read them, y'all. Uh, if you like to go see the original video, it will be up in the description. It will say original video, and then beside it should be the link. And hey, y'all, sorry, y'all, for the Fat Man's podcast. So I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace out, y'all.